Good morning and thanks for tuning in. I just wanted to take the time to show you guys a little something here. On the right, I have a PSA slab case. On the left, I have a PSA slab case. The only difference is this is the new case. This is the old case. Now, when I put the shadow on there, you're going to be able to see the little line right through the old case, right halfway down. Now, I've heard of some people saying they can swap cards out and this and that online and don't trust them. Now, the new case, however, it actually wraps around. You'll see there's no, um, they've eliminated um, that stuff. So obviously they're aware of it and thank you PSA for acknowledging this and um, you know taking the time to redesign your cases. I truly believe these new cases are awesome. They're a little bit higher, which is okay. Um, but yeah, so here we have a 1988 Brett Hall rookie card, Opeachy Mint 9. You'll notice underneath the St. Louis Blues album there, um, Opeachy. And this is the new case. I just want to, you know, throw this out there. 84 Opeachy Cam Neely Gem Mint 10. Um, beautiful card. This is one of my favorite cards from my collections. But uh, I just want to show you something I found today. So I was looking to add another uh, Opeachy Brett Hall rookie card. And here I am on eBay. So it's not an expensive card, but I just like it. So... 1988 Opeachy Brett Hall rookie card, number 66, PSA 9 Mint. I'll just zoom in on the case a little bit here. As you can see, 1988 Opeachy Brett Hall rookie Mint 9. But you'll notice, folks, that it's a tops card inside a Opeachy slab case. This is scary. The bad thing is, someone's actually bid on this. There's been 10 people bidding on this card. Now I have emailed the uh, reputable seller. Um, I wanted to, um, you know, hide his uh, listing there. Um, I didn't think it was fair. Um, obviously this was just overlooked. Like this is just scary. So if I click on the listing here, um, I can show you a little better here. So there you have it folks. A 1988 Opeachy Brett Hall rookie card, mint nine, with the tops card inside the Opeachy slab case. Scary stuff. Scary, scary, scary stuff. And as you can see here, there has been 10 bids, and it is going for $14.46 uh, US. Um, I don't know what to say about this. This completely changes my mind about some things, but one thing I do know is uh, I won't be buying any cards unless they're in a new case. And just to show you guys, today is February 13th, 2015, 9.52 a.m. I don't know what to say. I have nothing else to say. I did uh, decide to uh, open up another link here of the pictures. And I'll just show you quick here. And there you have it. 1980 Opeachy Bread Hall rookie card, Mint 9. But there's a tops card in the case. And there you go. There you have it. So, uh, Make sure you are watching your stuff carefully, looking at it, inspecting it. Um, I feel sorry. I have, like I said, I've emailed the uh, buyer and uh, or the seller, and I told them to take this down immediately. Um, whoever gave this up for consignment is just, they should be banned, um, you know, and that's all there is to it. This is uh, very unfortunate for everybody. But PSA, good job on the new cases.